Hey everybody, it's Josh here. I'm going to be doing a quick review uh, of my 16 gigabyte iPod Touch. Um, hopefully it won't take too long, but right now I'm just going to do a quick demo of uh, the Invisible Shield uh, screen protector. So, here you go. And here's a key. and no scratches which is nice because then I can actually put it in my pocket that way I don't have to dig it out of my backpack or something every day or every time I want to use it but now on to the review um, I, I really 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 like the device um, surprisingly the 16 gigabyte, gigabytes filled up quite fast uh, because I watch a lot of lot a lot of video podcasts um, but you know I have it set up so that way I'll always have room. It automatically deletes the old ones. Um, the Wi-Fi um, on this is really, really good. It's actually better than my MacBook Pro. I actually find myself able to get a connection on this and not my computer uh, sometimes. Um, and it's really, really slick. It's very intuitive. Um, as you can see, it's... It's a very thin device. Um, I wish uh, that it wouldn't glare so much so you could actually see, but maybe you can see some of the apps that I have on there. Try shutting off the light. No, not helping at all. Um, well, it... It's very fast, too. I think that might be because of the solid-state drive. Uh, and it gets... Uh, the battery life sucks when you're, like, watching a movie and you have Wi-Fi on. So if you're, like, in the car or something, turn the Wi-Fi off. You'll get a lot better battery life. And uh, But when you're listening to music, with this, like, when you turn the screen off or put it into standby mode, just go... Like that, pushing the button right up on top. Uh, I haven't had to charge it in like three days. Uh, which is quite nice. Uh, and it's a slick device. I really enjoy it. Uh, one of my main complaints was that the back got scratched really, really easily. Like within the first three days. And this is in my backpack in the iPod protecting part of it uh, and it still got scratched quite easily um, but so I might pick up my myself some uh, stuff to get rid of the scratches but uh, the invisible shield is on there so now I won't get any more uh, I'll be doing a review of that as well some qualms that I have with it uh, overall it's a great device very fast uh, the web the web browser, I I think it's very very, it's a very quick web browser. One thing though, this is kind of a big issue. No copy paste. I knew that it was. I was like, ah, oh, it's not going to be that big of a deal. But you find yourself whining it quite a bit. Another thing is, uh, in the applications, like when you go on a web on onto a web page, it'll. It'll turn. Well, it'll turn so that way when you type, that way you can use both your thumbs. But in in the applications, it doesn't do that. So you have to poke with your one finger or use multiple. You know, it's just not as easy to type with. Then uh, the App Store was really easy to use. I have Twitterific on there. If you Twitter, Pandora Radio and. Tap Tap Revenge. Other than that, it's pretty simple. I really like the device. I would highly recommend it. Uh, if you don't watch a lot of video podcasts, go with the 8 gig. Uh, if you do, I'd opt for the bigger hard drive. Uh, probably the 16 because the price difference isn't as big. Like the even even though you get 16 gigabytes more in the 32. 
you know, it's still not as big of an increase, and it still gives you a lot more space. Um, and you can't use it, like, on your PS3 or Xbox 360. It's just a thing with the touches, uh, which is... I wish it, you could do that until one of them releases a fix. Same for Flash on there. YouTube works, but nothing else does. Kind of a scrat scatterbrained review, uh, but I didn't script this one out. I just wanted to get the video out there uh, because it's been two weeks, I think, since I did the unboxing of it. Um, so I hope you like the video. Subscribe if you like. Uh, rate it. Comment on it. Um, and if you have any questions about anything, just feel free to send them my way, and I'll try to answer the best I can. Thanks for watching, and...